we are going to be running two content creators through the PvP gauntlet. And this guy's... <laughs> okay! <laughs> Today we are going to be running two content creators through the PvP gauntlet. Those content creators are Guns, Chili, and Soup. This is how the PvP gauntlet works. There are two teams. On one team is C Engineer and myself, and on the other team is Pure Spam and Kemp Q. Each team has to train one content creator to be the best PKer, and in the end, we run them through the gauntlet. The gauntlet is a series of a best of three fight between the two content creators in the end. These are all death matches, so they have to fight to the death. The first fight is going to be Dare Rocking, the second fight is going to be NH Breading, and if we get to the third fight, it is going to be a tank test. Whoever wins the PvP gauntlet gets a grand prize of 100 mil. Before we start, Guns Chili, Soup, do you guys have anything to say? I wish Tom the best of luck, but he's not coming out victorious here. That's all I'm saying. Wow. Oh, oh my gosh. Guns Chili, what do you have to say to that? Any rebuttal? No, I have nothing to say. I have confidence. <laughs> I don't have any confidence. <laughs> He's gonna I, thank show you, it. Thank He's you for watching me luck. I may need it. The first fight, we are doing a Derek fight against Soup. So me and Kevin here are here to train Mr. Ganshili, Tom. Hello. We're gonna see how he, well he does and um, get that fucking bread. Let's go. Yeah, let's get that bread. I swore. See, the thing about Derek that are I, not... I love, it's always very fast paced. Or we should probably give him some tips in the first fight, right? Yeah, yeah, or yeah. So, we kind of want to yeah. keep the uh, HP uh, uh, above. Oh. Oh, oh! No freaking way! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Right? Oh, my gosh. Been the <laughs> oh my gosh! Who is the real master? All right, all right. I, Guns Chili, so, I think you start teaching the engineer some tips, okay? It's me against Soup, right? Yeah, well, yeah. I'm gonna fight. <laughs> yeah, it's you against Soup. You need it. He might not even need it. What's your experience with DH? With DHPKing? I did a lot pre EOC. All right. Yeah, I know Soup used to actually do some DHing pre EOC as well. So he, he's got some experience with it, but I didn't expect that. Okay, right there, what you did was perfect. You were on half HP. You went for a calculated risk with the DH. It was your, or it's not your PID, but still, he didn't actually have the time to hit there. So that's good. See, the armor offs. I would say in normal DH fighting, the armor offs are good, but if you're gonna do this in a DM, you wanna, you know, not take as much damage as possible. No, yeah. Oh, oh all right. If it comes to the point where you believe that you have hit it more than soup, feel free to safe up because then, like, so there's no KO potential oh, on you. Uh, yeah, that's. Yeah. Yeah, sure. that, that's okay. Yeah, because it's a DM. That, that's a really good point. What I'm gonna be training you in is the art of the risk. So the art of the, the risk. art of the risk. So <laughs> as of right now, this is what I'm gonna need you to do. Meet me at the Castle Wars Bank. Oh shit! I have no idea what's going on. Okay. This is what I need you to do. Go into your bank. Do you have a rock cake perchance? I do. Go into your bank and grab a rock cake. Yep. Am I am All I right. gonna be guzzling? You are gonna be Kevin? guzzling it to one HP. Right now. Right Kevin? now. Right now, I'm guzzling as we speak. Are you gonna make me DH bomb someone? You just <laughs> might be doing that. So bank oh, your God. whip, bank your shield, and put on a DH axe. I also oh, want no. you to change out your glory for a strength amulet. And Wait, you are you gonna make me do this in PvP? Yes, you're gonna be doing oh, it. Follow me. God. Follow me, boys. <laughs> oh, shit. I know what I'm doing. Oh, no. The poor Iron Man. <laughs> <laughs> the poor Iron Man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Figured it out. <laughs> oh, there's a guy. He's skulled. You're gonna DH bomb this guy. He's trying to PK people here. Go to world 92. 92? 92. You'll see him. Where He's is in the black dehyde. Black dehyde right there. North. Alright, okay. Go for it. He's just here it goes. There. Bench. 23. Go for it. Go for it. Go for the axe. Stay on him. Stay on him. Okay. Stay on him! Just... Oh, stay, on stay on him! Yeah, stay on him! Stay on him! Come on! Stay on him! him. <laughs> stay on Come him! On. No! Oh, oh, the XP drop! No. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, so close! All right. My heart is racing. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. I'm not used to doing shit like this. Hey! <sighs> and I hit a zero. What's this? You're dying. You're dying. Oh, oh. You can't kick me up too. I can. I'm gonna kick you a two. This is such a. Come on! Yeah. 
I can't kick a two. I'm max. No! Oh my god! No! You hit a 100? Oh! Yeah. Since you couldn't kill someone else, I, I have an, I have another another group that we can uh, we can go for. All right. And we want to make it easy mode again on you, so we're we're gonna have someone that's not necessarily looking to fight back. So okay. what you need to do, go to world 370, Edgeville. All right. Oh, not the rune crafters, Kevin. <laughs> not the rune crafters, man. <laughs> Come on. There is a level 122 we can get. You have to get him in level four, of course, but that's not a big deal. And he's coming. By the ditch. Got the skeleton. Here he comes. Here he comes. Go, 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 go. Hit, the, hit all the skeletons. Go. Bomb him, bomb him, bomb him. Bomb him. Get him. Get him, get him. Keep going. Bomb him. Is it? No. One more time. One more Almost. hit. One more one hit. More, Stay one on more. him. Stay on him. Stay on him. <laughs> yes. There it is. Oh, man. Wait, he must have eaten or did I overhit? No, you overhit. Oh, oh my man. God, guys. I got a glory. <gasps> no way. Uh, All right. We're yes, gonna... way. Okay, so um, you're going to have to split that pick. with me glory. and the engineer. We're going to split that glory. We're going to split that and we're going we're gonna to pool all of our earnings nice. together. It's, it's mine now. See you later, guys. Oh. So the other fight that we need to prepare you for is the NH portion of the fight. And it is hard to explain NHing, but there are a few components that I want to cover with you to show you what you could do to gain the upper hand or the advantage here. So while I will say a lot of this is prediction and it is practice over time, the best thing that you are going to be able to do here is make sure that you land your prayers. If you are ever below 60 HP, just be weary that he could pull an AGS. You don't always want to switch to pray melee per se, but just always be aware that he can pull it. All right, ready? All right. Set. I'm ready. Go. Just remember, you're going to want to get some range in there. You don't want to just camp one thing nonstop. You're going to want to get some range in there, get some DPS in there as well. And just remember, he is going to be switching every now and then to range. You just, uh, right now, since you guys are at a Oh, distance, I, I forgot ammo. <laughs> uh, no problem, no problem. So, if you do want to be a little bit lazy and can't pray range, you can. Oh, go for the AGS. That was good. Again, because you're not going for the KO right now, that was super good. Because you definitely want to get the uh, or as much DPS on as possible. Alright, right now you're going to want to switch into range and you're going to want to uh, bolt him. You go for the mage before, it would actually refreeze them. And then you run back to pray range. Oh, and fuck. then you die to see engineer. That's not only what I like to do, <laughs> something like that. But you know what? That's okay. That's okay. It gave you a decent idea as to what to do. And mm -hmm. the best thing is, I have another plan for how you're going to practice NHing. Oh, 3A. 3A. Freeze him. All right. You know what to do. Every style you switch. Every style you switch. Every style you switch. Oh, I just you it's okay. Hit him. Switch styles. Hit him. Switch styles. Keep going. You're gonna want a barrage, by the way. Barrage is better for this. Oh really? <gasps> this blowpipe is gold. Yeah, and he has a dark blow as well. Wait, where? This guy. This guy. Freeze him. Freeze him. Freeze him. I got him. Freeze him. Do whatever you can to get the kill now. Whatever you can. The prerogative has changed. Refreeze? Or did refreeze. they have the shortcut? No. I'm still on him though. Ooh, con dragon. Let's go. Uh, I might get him like this. Catch the freeze, catch the freeze. See I can't out of energy with no stamina. Oh, I got him anyway, I got oh, him. Dead. It's okay. Oh my gosh, yeah, I got a dark bow from him. You got a dark bow? Holy I got a shit. dark bow. <laughs> now that the training is complete, the fights can begin. Round one of the PvP gauntlet begins now. Two content creators step into the ring, one leaves. The first match is going to be a DH match to the death. Guns Chili versus Soup. See, Engineer, you did that wrong. Hey, TV. <laughs> <laughs> Fight! Good luck, bro. Good luck. Here we go. Good luck, good luck. Good luck. On our right, we have stop. Superhero. On our left, we have Eidfap, which does not mean that he would touch himself. It means in debt for a pet. <laughs> Because he goes in debt for pets because he does not like himself. He wants to always go and make sure that he is just completely broke every single time he makes a video because he wants to make it tougher on himself. That is the best part about it. You see him stepping in the ring 
And Ian, I'm going to need you to take it away because I've never done this before and I don't plan to start now. <laughs> well, straight off the bat, you see Sukhani with there. Darok's axe, the Vengeance, a really nice timing from him as well. I'd fap. It's a little squeal from Tom. He's afraid. But I'll go for an axe here. He doesn't go for it. Oh, could have been there, right there. Unfortunate there for you, mate. Let me talk to you guys a little bit about your strategies. What were you preparing, Stop Tom? With? How did you get him through? So what we wanted to set up is we wanted to make sure that he understands the risk versus reward factor. He's going for the armor offs right there, which is what we told him not to do in practice. <laughs> 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 so we we, uh, we want to have him understand risk versus rewards. So you go for a hit when you have a certain amount of HP. We want to make sure that you don't risk it when you don't need to. Overall, it's just good in, uh, to have a good sense of what you want to go for, when you should go for your axe, when you should take the chances, when you got to go for that spec that's what we taught him dude that pull out there from super swell i mean tom if you if went for the axe there i mean super could easily very easily died right now sorry, save just a little bit you should be sorry because now soup's gonna have to save up as well but to be fair the one thing we taught soup the best out i think he's been very very well at is the triple eating his combo eating is impeccable he was sat on like 10 hp once and um Kemp, he went oh, oh my god i take it back oh, where is the food so, oh, oh round one you goes the gun's Ooh, chili oh, round one gun's chili left. oh sorry no. <laughs> That's a rip, dude. I was spamming it. I thought I was on it. Oh man, that was you. Were, that was so set up well for you. You were showing us so many yeah, amazing yeah, triple uh, that whole time. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, so for hell. the next round, what we are going to be going for is the <laughs> NH round. We're oh! going to see. Oh my gosh, Soup coming in for the redemption kill, almost getting it as well. <laughs> Three points, Mr. Ganshelli, Mr. Tom. Well done. You killed him, that's all that matters. You ate, very good. You did some combo eats, very nice. Point three. This is the fight of your life. No matter what you have to do, kill him. The only thing that I would say that you should not do is take your freaking armor off. Don't do that. But, uh, yeah, I'm listen, not going to do that. Listen, first, I, get, I get it. It was okay. style points. You got lucky. He, he hit you with zero. But that extra HP, he could have hit you. It could have been the difference. But you know what? <laughs> it's okay, because just like his quest guides, he's not that good. <laughs> <PK. No. laughs> okay, okay, okay. I think you have what it takes. I think you can pull a nice 2 0. What do you have to say? What do you think is going to happen? How do you think this fight's going to go? I'm, I'm going to swoop the soup, man. Oh, how I'm going to fly in. How long were I'm you gonna, thinking of that one? I literally Googled Rhyme Zone Soup for this for this consultation, and the first thing I saw was swoop. So. You know what? I'm going to give you bonus points. If Absolutely. you kill him for a 73, I'm going to give you an extra 25 mil if you kill him for a 73. Listen, I mm -hmm. think you have this in the bag. While our practice was a little bit rough, I think you get the basic concept of it down. You have it down. You have the, the switches almost down. I'll give you that. It is a different environment that we're going to be in. So you might have just had a little bit of uh, performance anxiety before. But I think you're going to have what it takes. So make us proud. I will. I hope. Yeah. And now for the second round of the first ever PvP gauntlet. In the first match, Gunshilly took the lead after Super risked it a little too low to a Darox axe. And in our second round, Super needs to clutch back a win to stay in his best of three. This second fight will be a no on a hybrid. With that being said, is everybody ready? Yes. Yep. Three, oh. two, one, go. <laughs> that boxing match, right? Yeah. Right, here we go. Both players trying to clutch that freeze off the bat. Soup, Stefan catching it very nicely here. Now he can go for an Aegis swing whenever he wants. He can also go for some freezes. And I'd fap going for the bolts, but taking a lot of damage at the same time. Soup going to go for any fakies, just bolting him down as best he can and prioritizing his defensive praise first. And look at that fakie, and I'd fap falls for it. Only getting hit a nine by the crossbow, though. And now both players are going to get that extra freeze now to see who can start exchanging those AGSs. Obviously, having the AGS is the main spec weapon. A lot of code potential there, especially if Idefap sits this low in HP. I've been talking the whole time. <laughs> oh, oh, it is! The AGS AGS oh, the 41. The 41. Oh, man. Soup had Guns Chili on the ropes for the first bit of the fight. But, oh, the 31. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's starting to be a little bit more balanced. I think Soup is a bit more ahead right now. Guns Chili missing those overhead prayers. That's super vital in a position like this. But I mean, he's, he's clutched ahead. I mean, those, those AGS Ooh. swings as well really making the difference. He does the oh, DPS. Bro. Look at this, man. He's absolutely obliterating him. He needs this win, though, if he wants to stay in this competition right now. It's a best of three. If Guns Chili does take it, he wins the 100 mil grand prize. Did we mention that? Yes, absolutely. Okay, good. Thank <laughs> God. That's true. Really no grand prize. Again. Can you imagine? As of right now, Guns Chili is just getting faked out left and right by Soup. Soup stepping in, going for that vital AGS. Oh, the, the four, the 12. He didn't even miss, he missed the prayer. Guns Chili is just panicking right now. 
Soup running off Nicely screen, making soup. it really hard well for the camera operator right now. But you know what? Camera <laughs> operator is pulling through. Soup right now, definitely having guns chilly on the ropes. So yeah, I mean, look, he's just absolutely flying around, trying to chuck those god sword swings in too, obviously, and just dominating the fight pretty much. I'd fap, keeping the prey melee up. He knows obviously that Soup does an AGS specs. He's been very careful about it. going for the fakey too, and Soup falling for it, but getting his prey melee up just in time. And unfortunately for him, I'd fap does catch the freeze through the prayer. Now I'd fap going on the offensive as well with the range hits. Unfortunately, hitting zeros for him, and with the wrong prayer up as well. Soup trying to go for another AGS, but he is frozen in place. The ball oh. 36 in the wrong prayer. Oh man, he's absolutely tearing through. It's just, it's just constant from, from either side right now. I don't know who's actually in the lead with food left. Oh man, this is just getting really intense. Pulling the AGS. They both pull the AGS out. Soup gets oh! the prey melee. Gun Chili misses the overhead. He whacks with the staff. He's panicking right now. He's on the ropes right now. It looks like he's about out of food, somewhere thereabouts. Very low on food. Well because it, it was actually a good attempt for Idefab to kill him right there. If the Aegis spec hit, Soup could have been KO'd. And uh, yeah, right now, as you said before, Idefab looks to be out of food. Can he bring back the amazing clutch with this HP left? Does Soup have anything left either? Oh, uh, he looks man. like he's got a bit of supplies left. Soup is on the ropes. Guns Chili looking like he is completely out of food. Can he pull back the clutch? He has a very limited chance. Oh! oh! <laughs> he had the man, chance. He had the time, chance. Man. Oh, man. But I'll tell you Soup's what, Soup's though, clutch yeah. of the prayer. That was Soup absolutely falling out beautiful ball. right there. It should be Soup's game now with the last AGS whack right here, taking a little bit. Good 35, time. Guns Chili oh. is down. Oh. Soup with the win. Up. That is 1-1 oh. one, one to Soup. We are going to the third yeah. challenge. We are going to be going to the, to the third final. and final challenge. Soup, oh. what do you have to say about this match? Uh, my hands are shaking so bad, dude. Like... <laughs> Uh, well, you, well, you pulled out oh, the clutch so cool. win, Guns Chili. You had him on the uh, pretty much. You had him the entire time. We're really gonna see what this. I third think round uh, is. just to com as a noob PKer to comment on NH Britting in old school, it's it's there's a lot going on at once. So I can understand how people are like sort of intimidated by it, especially me, because if you like, miss I was telling them earlier, if you like, for example, miss a barrage. And you're constantly splashing, constantly splashing. You can, you know, can get to your head and everything. It can force you to mess up your prayers. Uh, you can mess up eating your stuff, which is uh, I mean, it's a lot going on. So it's oh my I mean, god, it's still part of Castle Wars. I, I think he did deserve that win there, but Guns Chili had like he had two, uh, maybe two, maybe even three good opportunities to KO you I there with AGS. Yeah, they, they were. Chances, but otherwise yeah. you were far more solid. It's RNG. I mean, that's the game. Yeah. The current score is 1-1. One, one. The two teams are fighting for the final fight for the 100 mil. They're going to tank against the teachers. So me and Framed are going to attack Mr. Soup here. Camp Q and Pure Spam are going to attack Guns Chili. Whoever is the last man standing wins themselves 100 mil. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Good luck, Smart. Oh! What are you oh. doing, Barrage? You mean, <laughs> Single <Yeah>. spells! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna advise because your teachers are f***ing stupid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, he's, he's working us. Oh, that's a big bolt. <laughs> Go on. Oh, I could've got him there if I got a big stack. How are you doing? Go on. Soup, <laughs> you okay? We're yeah, doing our thing. Oh, we are freaking destroying him right now. Ripping Man, we through some him. more DPS, dude. I'm hitting zeros. <laughs> Why is Guns Chili such a tank? Come on. <laughs> Oh man, we are oh. destroying him. Oh, we could have killed him now. You are? Yeah, we are destroying him right now. Mate, no! You are so... going down. <laughs> I'm seeing zeros. My tactic is working. Oh, is yours man. just pray mage the whole time, pretty much, and stand at the same tank here? Yeah. I've not <laughs> seen kind of. much pray mage up. Soup. Mage, dude. Look, they're maging you. Oh, my no, God. I've been doing it. Don't <laughs> worry. <laughs> <laughs> Trays are much more important than armor. I'm gonna I'm get specked out by DDS. So it's good. I got spec left, Matt. <laughs> He's getting yeah, better the more you practice. Oh, big ball! <laughs> Go on, shut oh, up. Oh, big ball! Oh! Oh, no, no. my God. Thank it, thank it. Oh, my gosh, the luck. That was a 52 ball, dude. Bro, what? Oh. Thanks for the report. <laughs> 
suggestions constantly. Oh, he's out. Questions. He's out. Let's get him. No, gotta finish no, it off. No. Finish it. No, oh, yes. Yeah. Hey. Gunsilly is left? the winner. Oh say. my yeah. god. How much food? Necklace and two current bonds left. <laughs> is oh. that it? Oh yeah. my god. Oh. If, 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 oh, honestly, man. I think if Soup didn't have that terrible start, you guys would have won that. Oh. I, got, I got hit at 52 right there at the end there, too. Oh, kebab. Hello. Big boy bolts. <laughs> well, that was a, a well played fight from both your ends, to be honest. I think you both tanked really, really well. Bye, I camp. think. <laughs> <laughs> well, I literally DC'd. Yeah. I literally DC'd. <laughs> so free and easy, dude. That's why I love fighting Kim. Guns Chili, <laughs> as the very first winner of the PvP Gauntlet, I am here to award you the big cash prize of 100 mil. <gasps> <gasps> For me? <laughs> oh, Thank you so God. much. Congratulations, you earned you. it. Do you have anything to say as the winner? Um, if I get a pet, I gotta stake it, so I appreciate it, but... Well, who just died? Oh, okay, don't worry. <laughs> um, I wanna say good fight to Soup. He was a very formidable opponent. Opponent. Um, his skills in the NH fight probably deserve him the win overall, but... You're a shit tank, and I deaxed you for oh! 41. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what about you, oh, Steve? Did you learn anything from coming to, to this? To the nah, Gauntlet? this was. I'm just, you know, I'm just blessed to be in the situation where I can hop in Discord and make an amazing video with all my friends, you know, and stuff. Yeah, and that, that was, was, he goes for oh, that's, that's such a loser thing you know, to say, though. So. It was. Congrats on it the was, loss. It was a lot of fun, though, and I do love soups. So. No, it was uh, super fun. Learned a lot, and like I said, had a great time. So thank you for. Well, hopefully, hopefully, in the future, we'll oh. see you guys back, and maybe rather than fight each other, you might be working together. We'll have to wait and see. Well, thank you guys for Congratulations again next. to Mr. Eidfap, and thanks to both of you for joining the PvP gauntlet. I highly recommend watching the other team's video because it gives you a full picture as to what this challenge is really all about. Knowing what they actually put soup through as well is very entertaining, so definitely make sure you don't miss it down below. If you guys did enjoy this video and you want to see another PvP gauntlet or you want to see more challenge videos from myself, Kemp, C Engineer and Pure Spam, as well as other content creators you would like to see featured, then leave the video a like and let us know down below.